so hello folks welcome back to the channel as you can see i am again in no man's sky because plenty of you asked me information or to make a video about how to optimize the performance of this game which is incredibly demanding so at the moment i am in space and i have like a very nice stable 90 fps okay my settings are all at ultra okay tapped the uh, dlss quality which is set on performance okay obviously things are gonna change as soon as i go in a planet and i want to show you how we get uh, like a frame rate drop as soon as we get on a planet but still we're gonna have like a playable frame rate well at least for me it's playable which is uh, around 60. as i approach to the planet still a stable 90 fps as soon as i enter it ooh, still stable you can see that i don't have major stuttering if you have followed my video on how to fix no man's sky stuttering okay so now I'm gonna land on this planet and I'm gonna see what is the frame rate that I'm getting. So I'm gonna go here where there is a little bit of water as well, just to see and land. As you can see, the frame rate already dropped from 90 to around 70, okay? Fine, so we go out, you know, looks pretty nice, still keeping around 80 FPS with all the whistles and bells that I can get. So the game is very playable. However, not everyone can uh, take all the settings as ultra, but there is only one settings that you have to change to drastically improve the performance and a couple more to just, you know, tweak it a little bit, okay? And this setting is, oh, a little bit of suspense, planet quality. So you have to change planet quality and you can put it to standard or enhanced and see what's happening, you know? You will have to uh, reboot to see the effect. So bear with me a second while I reboot. Right, so planet, we changed the planet quality and now we look at our FPS and ta-da 90 frames per second looking in the same direction i was looking before you see there is a massive massive performance gain if you change only that settings now obviously you have a little bit of degradation in quality but the eye candy i believe is still there we haven't touched any other settings so it's pretty cool that we can get like a nice 90 frames per second Obviously, you're not gonna get this uh, everywhere in every place because No Man's Sky is really depends on where you look. You're gonna have like frame rate drops. Look, I I'm looking at this now, and for some reason, I'm getting 70 frames per second. But you know, it's a nice progress from what we have we had before. There are other two other settings you can change, and I will show it to you what which of these are without uh, penalizing too much the look of it. And those two are the post-processing and reflection, okay? So if we put them on enhanced instead of ultra, okay, we apply, we're gonna get uh, a little better design. Look, I have a little bit lower frame time. Yeah, and this, I have to say that I haven't touched uh, the resolution of the game okay apart well technically I, I did with the dlss but i'm running at the quest 3 native resolution another thing you can do is to actually reduce the resolution on steam but to do so you go to the application settings and you go to the video setting over here and you can think about reducing this value perhaps to a little bit lower uh, value perhaps 75 percent okay right so and uh, now i'm running it at uh, uh, 76 percent resolution looking at there you know i have much better you know total resolution setting 76 percent does look a little bit worse of course because you know we are reducing the resolution but it still looks pretty amazing to me 
and the frame rate is a little bit more stable even though you know we go like in that area um, so you can see you know the game in all ultra is perfectly playable however you know if you want to really gain in performance you need to change the planet quality as the main thing right this gives you like uh, 30 fps back to you at least in my test then you can play with the post-processing and reflection you can put them down and uh, to enhance to gain some other fps probably if i do it now it's not very visible the effect but i can see it on the frame time reducing uh, quite a bit okay if i put it down, up again now i should get an increase in frame time as you can see then other things you can change you know i tried to put the volumetric effects to enhance there's not much not much of an effect as you can see nothing pretty much changed put it back to ultra apart from the stuttering you have there it doesn't change at all uh, i tried the tessellation i tried other things you know uh, it doesn't really affect uh the performance texture quality obviously i left it at the ultra because i have a 1490 but uh, if you can you know if you don't want to have uh, a massive impact on visuals then you should keep it uh, at the uh, high because otherwise it will look really 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 bad i can show it to you actually standard look the hands look really really bad look at the hands over here but if you go on and, and and i didn't get any gain in performance okay if i put it here ultra yeah you can see already the hands look much much better okay and that applies to everything else and performance didn't decrease maybe one or two frames per second but i think that's what it is animation quality if i put it to standard nothing nothing change nothing probably a slight reduction in cpu frame time but it's not really measurable you see no and shadow quality also this one doesn't really change you see i put it down and the fps are always uh, always the same looking that direction so it doesn't change incredible isn't it i put it on ultra um so yeah the only thing a post-processing i put it on standard and i do have a measurable effect on both frame rate frame rate and the frame time okay but yeah again the biggest effect that you have it with the planet quality okay anyhow i hope you liked this video thank you very much for watching if you liked it please don't forget to like and subscribe for more vr content so now i think i'm gonna go and i will see you next time we are dead signing out